I'm April. I'm a skincare and cosmetic chemist, and I talk about all things skincare, back end, front end of all things skincare. So if you're interested in that, definitely hit that like button for me down below. Subscribe to the channel because we're here every week, every single week, talking about skincare. All right, guys. So this video is one that has been requested quite a lot. And I've gotten questions about sensitive, sensitized skin. Now, though I've made a video up here about like sensitive skin, it was more geared towards teenagers because they're the subset of people that are currently going through changes or a lot of changes in their skincare. So in this video, I really want to talk about sensitive and sensitized skin because there is a difference. And um, I feel like a lot of people tend to confuse these skin conditions quite a lot. And I really wanted to make sure that I made it clear in this video and, you know, sort of just elaborated a lot more on uh, what these skin types mean. And of course, recommend products that are great for these skin conditions. I'm going to go through really quickly what it means to have these skin types. So sensitive skin basically means that you have an allergy to certain ingredient or ingredients. Most times sensitive skin is from genetics, maybe one of the parents or both of your parents are allergic to a certain ingredient. Typically, if that's the case, you will have sensitive skin and you will react to those ingredients. Now sensitized skin, it literally means what the name says. Your skin is sensitized to an ingredient or multiple ingredients. So maybe from overexposure, from maybe using too high of a dosage, it's a skin condition that happens over time. It's not something that happens, you know, like I said earlier, for sensitive skin, you're just born that way, right? So this one is definitely more of a learned uh, skin condition. And it's so hard because this skin type, I mean, it's hard, but it's easy in a way because that way, like you know exactly, or at least most people know exactly what they're sensitive to so they tend to only buy certain products versus people like us that are not very sensitive to anything I, I can buy any skincare but then that just means I get to spend a lot of coins on skincare items that I don't need so anyway some of the ingredients that are sensitive or sensitized skin condition people tend to be allergic to our fragrances things like SLS essential oils botanical extracts so on and so forth if you want me to do a video on ingredients that you probably avoid if you have these skin conditions make sure to thumbs up and I definitely would do it and today's video I actually have good news for you guys I'm going to be recommending a skincare routine that works for either of these skin types that's why I'm partnering with April skin for today's video April skin is a K beauty skincare brand that believes in high performance low irritation products their whole brand is literally centered around that which just made sense for me to partner with them pretty much all their products are centered around people who have a struggling with sensitive skin or just skin that's more prone to irritation or inflammation now without further ado let's just dive into the products for today's video so i'm just going to go through like you know a whole routine starting with the cleanser the cleanser that i have to recommend today is the avino calm and restore nourishing oat cleanser and i don't have it physically with me right here but i've made tons of videos on my TikTok. This cleanser is so gentle. It hydrates my skin while also preserving my skin barrier. It doesn't give me that squeaky clean feeling that a lot of harsh cleansers tend to give me. It contains glycerin and sodium hyaluronate so it keeps your skin moisturized while also cleansing your skin. It's also fragrance free and if you remember I talked about fragrance is one of the things that might be allergenic to you if you have sensitive skin so it's fragrance free so it's perfect if you have sensitive or sensitized skin. Now moving on to some of the products from today's sponsor April Skin. This is the Calendula 10 percent pha plus aha resurfacing serum it has a complex of pha and aha at 10 percent now pha i've talked about in a video up here in more detail you see it as a gluconolactone on your ingredient list pha basically is an exfoliant it has really high molecules and it's very great especially for people of color it doesn't go rapidly into the skin it has bigger molecules so it gently releases into your skin to help slow off dead skin cells from your skin. It also has glycolic and lactic acid in there, which lactic acid is a natural moisturizing factor, so it'll keep your skin moisturized while exfoliating your skin. So you guys see it's a trend here. Basically, it's doing what it's supposed to do, but it's also soothing and calming your skin. Another thing I love about this one is it has calendula. Calendula has antimicrobial, antibacterial properties. The extract form of calendula in this product is great for reducing signs of skin aging. So after your exfoliant serum, you move on to your serum. And this one is the Curatine Clarifying Serum. It's a sebum clarifying serum. And I love this one because it has niacinamide in a really great dosage that's really great for especially people of color or really any skin type. And you guys know I love niacinamide on this channel because niacinamide uses a different pathway to treat hyperpigmentation compared to the other tyroxinase inhibitors. Niacinamide is really really gentle. It's also going to help control excess oil on your skin, help refine your skin texture. It's also great if you're struggling with maskne as well as if your skin is acne prone. This serum has really really changed the game for me. I've also given it to like my family member and they absolutely are loving loving this serum. It's also a non-comedogenic serum so it would not clog your pores. One of the key ingredients of this product is that it contains beta-carotene. 
from three carrot derived ingredients. It's a precursor to retinol which helps with fire blemishes, bumps and breakouts. Another thing I really love about it is it contains hyaluronic acid as well as plant oils to help calm and hydrate your skin to prevent any skin irritation. So this serum is just really packed with a lot of functional ingredients in there that will really just help just boost your skin back to its optimal health. And it works really good with the PHA exfoliant serum in a synergistic manner to really just give you your best desired skin. Okay moving on to moisturizer. This is the Artemisia Squalane Hydro Gel Cream. Love this cream. I've used it a few times and you guys have received compliments on compliments every time that I've used it. It literally makes your skin glow honey. Like glow for the gods. <laughs> Artemisia is actually a skin healing herb that helps to soothe sensitive skin. It helps to calm redness to soothe any irritation on the skin. It contains hyaluronic acid and plant-based squalane which is a great emollient that helps to trap moisture while sealing the skin and prevent water loss. Oh. And finally of course you want to finish up with the sunscreen. I've talked about this sunscreen many many times. This is the Bodai Sense SPF 50 broad spectrum sunscreen. It's fragrance free, suitable for sensitive skin so it's made for people with sensitive or sensitized skin. I love love this product. I showed it on my TikTok. Literally I have abused it on using it on my TikTok. Or just even in real life. I'm almost out of it actually. It's very animal friendly. It's not comedogenic. It won't clog your pores. It's not greasy. It just gives you a glow from the inside out. Also contains various antioxidants like vitamin E. I love love this product. I mean I've raved about it before in my other videos. Um, one, of the, one of my great finds for sunscreens in 2021 for sure. And yeah that's it for this video. Thank you April Skin for sponsoring this video and I'm sure you guys are thinking is this your brand? No it's not my brand. Um, <laughs> it just happens to have the same name as me so I mean it's just all fitting right? It just makes sense and then their products are just as amazing. Um, so anyway and thank you guys so much for watching. So as I said if you have sensitive sensitized skin not to worry. You are in good hands. You have a unique skin type that we, we're all secretly jealous of because you guys have just unique specific products that are made just for you guys and who doesn't want that um, <laughs> make sure to check out the videos at the end of this video I will link my video where I talked about skincare routine for teenagers as well as my playlist for just skincare and also throughout the video I linked really helpful videos on my video cards so definitely check those out and don't forget to subscribe like the video if you enjoyed it and found it valuable it really really helps out the algorithm um, it just helps other people find out my videos Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.